Hey, it's James from Down and Nerdy, and oh, what a year it was for DC TV, and now all of them, seems like week after week after week, are hitting Blu-ray and DVD and digital, and this one right here was the surprise hit of the year, if you ask me. That's right, DC Stargirl, and uh, look how great that looks on Blu-ray. And on digital, it's the only way you're going to get the free digital copy, by the way, it's if you buy the Blu-ray. Before I start unboxing this thing, Warner Brothers Home Entertainment provided me with a free copy of this Blu-ray for review and unboxing, so any opinions expressed are my own. Let's take a look inside. As you can see, the cover of the poster here for the Blu-ray not only includes the JSA, the Justice Society of America, but the Injustice Society as well. Maybe not all the members. But some of the members right there, pretty much all the members of the JSA up here, which we got to see them throughout the season, you know, one after the other, and everybody kind of got their own spotlight. Not just for the JSA, but for the ISA as well, which I thought was a really, really cool part of this season. And Pat Dugan, everybody's favorite TV dad of the last year, at least mine, anyway. The only one that's missing on here, actually two, are, are Mike and Barbara, who I thought played a really good role in this season as well. So let's just go ahead and dive into this thing here, shall we? It comes in a bit of a slim case too. I know that some of these have a lot of discs to them sometimes, but as you can see from the spine here, it's a nice slim case. So it's almost like a standard DVD or Blu-ray, and there's your big synopsis right there for the season. Talk about carrying the torch, right? And that's a big, you know, a big debate about this season is, you know, who was Courtney's real dad? Who was her dad? That was a big part of this season. And I love the way that it played out as we go along as well. No surprise here. These two things are about pretty much the same on the outside. All right, and as we pop this thing open, and the reason I'm holding this off here is because I want to make sure that I take this out. There's the discs right there. Your digital copy, if, you, if, you, if this is your first time seeing one of these, Yep, there it is right there. That's what it's going to look like. Okay, it tells you where to go and everything like that. This one does also, by the way, come with your episode guide, too. So it tells you, and you notice how a lot of them, like you've got Stripe, you've got Stargirl, you've got Icicle, you've got Wildcat there. Again, this is telling you that a lot of these, this is when a lot of the characters are either going to get their introduction or it's going to get their spotlight. What I also love is we get some photos from the season down there as well. Don't always get that for these sets, by the way. So that's a really, really cool thing that they did for this as well. You get Stargirl herself on the discs. Some of these might popped out of the case and shipping for you, so just keep that in mind. Be very careful opening up your copy once you get yours. Pretty much all three discs, the same thing. The one thing you do not get with this Blu-ray set that you might be used to from the Arrowverse is the Crisis on Infinite Earths bonus disc that's come with a lot of these other Blu-rays. But remember, Stargirl not a part of that crossover, so that's probably the reason why Crisis on Infinite Earths Blu-rays Blu-ray was not included on this one. But I mean, an amazing first season of DC Stargirl. I'll go ahead and put up any special features or anything like that up on the website at downandnerdypodcast.com if you want to check that out. There's some Really good stuff that comes with this Blu-ray, but season one of Stargirl alone worth the price of admission. So make sure you're getting your copy of Stargirl, DC Stargirl, the complete first season on Blu-ray and DVD available now at your favorite retailer.